Hey everybody, welcome back to the shop. Ten more minutes to the Chief building action. Ah, oh, you didn't expect me back so quick, did you? So Bob's gonna be loafing till that. He's ready for some more resin. <laughs> ah, sight. No loafing for me, man. I got this freight train rolling, and it's rolling downhill. So I hope you ain't standing on the tracks. And we'll just mow right through your boof. Well, bam! <laughs> okay, now, what I'm doing here, I know y'all what y'all thinking. Well, what's Bob doing with that mold? I thought he was done with it. No, we got one more use for this. No. I'm going to keep this around, you know, there's... Might be someone don't want to mess with the opening canopy, you know. And this one is just fine. It's a nice mold. Plus, it's the mother mold. You know. We're just going to keep it around for a while. But, what I'm doing. is going to make me a plug for a canopy. Okay. The Paul and them said... Paul's got a buddy that's got a vacuum form machine. I was going to build one. They're pretty simple. Oh, you know, Balcom's got, he's a heating and air man. He's got some heater coils. But, uh, and a uh, shop back and some pegboard and a little bit of wood. You know, it, it'd take a, a day or two to build this one, but I'm just going to go ahead and let Paul take care of it. So if I casted it up, uh, he'll get it, he'll get us some canopy. So, Put me some wax on there. Oh, hey. Before I forget, the eight minutes left. Get the old Bob O'Timer going. Okay, now I'm just going to use. I was a floor guy, you guys know, for a long time. And about that best patch out there, the hardest. No, that is that rock hard water putty, man. I don't know if y'all ever messed with that. That stuff's like grand. <laughs> okay, that's what this is. This rock hard floor underlayment. Okay, it's got an actual latex in it and everything. Well, it's really good. So we're going to mix this stuff up. We're going to pour it right in there. setting up stuff so we ain't gonna have to wait long either.
hope this works all right. I figure we'll just let it sit for a few days, let the water get out of it. And uh, I'll be just fine, you know, let the moisture come out of it a little bit and dry it out. Shoot, it would take a whole gallon of Bondo. That's 30 bucks. And this whole bag was six dollars, you know. We're, we're on building on a budget in the shop. Don't ever forget that. The thing to do is let this stuff slate up for just a minute. You don't have a lot of working time. If you let it set slate up for just a minute, the clumps will break up. Okie dokie. Yeah, you all stay over here and watch and I'll try not to splash this stuff all over you. Alright, back you up just a little bit. Get that cam like banner in there. too much. just as smooth as that mold is. Don't be able to pop it out here in an hour or so. Uh oh. We're getting close on time. I don't need to go up, but about another inch. 